स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट द नेक्स्ट मॉड्यूल ऑफ अवर साइंस एंड यू नो द मॉड्यूल इज फोटो सिंथेसिस ओके सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट टू फोटो सिंथेसिस ओके वॉट इज फोटो सिंथेसिस द प्रोसेस बाय विच द ग्रीन प्लांट्स प्रिपेयर देयर ओन फूड बाय द हेल्प ऑफ सनलाइट वाटर सी ओ टू एंड क्लोरो फिल इज कॉल्ड फोटो सिंथेसिस सिंपली यू कैन से दैट द प्रोसेस बाय विच ऑल ग्रीन वेजिटेशन इंक्लूडिंग ब्लू ग्रीन एलगी ओके मीन्स साइनो बैक्टीरिया एंड ऑल द ग्रीन कैटेगरी ऑफ प्लांट्स मीन्स ऑल द ग्रीन प्लांट्स प्रिपेयर देयर फूड बाय द प्रोसेस ऑफ फोटो सिंथेसिस ओके देन वॉट इज द कम्प्लीट और प्रॉपर साइट फॉर photosynthesis okay so the site for photosynthesis that is the leaves because you know that leaves are the food factory of plants okay and uh, these leaves having various type of cells like mesophyll cells are there these mesophyll cells are containing large quantity of chlorophyll and what is chlorophyll chlorophyll means the green pigment okay the green pigment which is present in the plant body and help for the absorption of sunlight right so what is the site of photosynthesis that is the leaves okay why these leaves are the site for photosynthesis because leaves are considered the food factory of plants okay and uh, we earn from that you know sunlight from the sun water from the soil co2 from the atmosphere carbon dioxide okay and including chlorophyll these all are the four raw materials for photosynthesis okay which will perform in leaves right after that we will discuss how the process will takes place so first sunlight is obtained from the sun as we have already discussed water absorbed by the roots of the plant okay then transport to the leaves okay then co2 from the atmosphere through the small pores called stomata okay and chlorophyll are green pigments which are present in the leaf these all components combine together to perform the process of photosynthesis as you can see here this is the structure of leaf okay and this leaf will contains the small small pores and these small pores are called these small pores are called uh, stomata okay and with the help of stomata the gaseous exchange will takes place okay here you can observe the complete structure of stomata also okay minute pores are looking here okay and uh, they will exchange the gases internally and externally both of the situation means outside the inside outside to inside and inside to outside okay after that we will discuss about two complete anatomy of leaf this is the surface of leaf as you can observe here this is the surface of leaf and this leaf surface will contain the anatomical structure okay and this anatomical structure is very very important as you can see here the different type of cells are there like palisade mesophyll cells are there spongy mesophyll cells are there upper epidermis lower epidermis okay inside it there is the small small spaces and these spaces are called air sacs okay so this is the anatomical structure of leaf right and he, here you can also see the uh, condition of plant cell okay the plant cell will contains the various type of cellular components right as you know the basic structure of the cell that is the nucleus okay then cytoplasm 
after that this is the type of plant cell so it must have to contain the chloroplast cell wall okay vacuole will be very large in plant cell that is all about to plant cell after that you know chlorophyll uses the energy from sun to prepare food by using of other components like water co2 okay and chlorophyll from itself okay now we will discuss about to the equation of photosynthesis here you can see co2 plus water okay in the presence of sunlight with the help of chlorophyll okay after that it will give the carbohydrate carbohydrate means what is the means of carbohydrate here carbohydrate means glucose okay the glucose will produce the form of food okay and along with glucose you can see here uh, carbohydrate plus oxygen these both are the end product of photosynthesis in the next diagram you can see here how the process will takes place okay as you can see here energy means sunlight energy it is getting from the sun is providing the sun energy and uh, with the help of sunlight energy you know the process will coordinated okay so sunlight energy from the sun co2 from the atmosphere water from the soil with the help of roots okay and chlorophyll it also having okay means green plants are containing chlorophyll as a end product glucose and oxygen these both are the end product of photosynthesis okay in next video we will discuss about to synthesis of various type of nutrients like protein okay and uh, carbohydrate etc okay so thank you